Set up your baby monitor for enhanced connectivity and benefit from product firmware updates. First, connect the parent unit to the adapter and main supply. Make sure you raise the antenna of the parent unit. It is a necessity, or the monitor will not function normally. Then, connect your baby unit to the adapter and main supply, and switch it on. Also, check that your Wi-Fi network is online, password protected, and your internet speed meets the minimum requirements for streaming video. Now, you can use the buttons on the parent unit and follow the instructions. Use the navigation key to enter the Wi-Fi password. And use the up arrow on the keyboard to switch between upper and lowercase characters. When complete, select Done. You should see the router mode icons on the top left corner of the parent unit, which means the baby monitor is in a stable Wi-Fi connection. If you see three bars in any of the icons on the parent unit, the baby monitor is not in router mode. Please check your Wi-Fi signal and set up the Wi-Fi connection again to connect the baby monitor in router mode for best connectivity and always ready for firmware updates. To update the software, you can check and update your software manually by going to the General Setting tab and choosing Software Update. If an update is ready the baby unit will update automatically, while the parent unit will prompt you to reboot the system into the latest software. Select Done and reboot the system. The baby unit and parent unit will also automatically check for updates every 4 hours and 8 hours respectively. Now you can enjoy a more enhanced connection. After updating, the connection is set to router mode by default. Using router mode will allow you to receive future software updates when available. And you can experience smooth video streaming on your parent unit and the app. For more helpful tips, subscribe to VTech Support Channel and check out our videos.